Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Carlos and I'm back with another video. In today's video, we're going to talk about our possible January transfer targets. And by possible, I mean the transfer rumors that have been surrounding the club lately. For those new viewers that are recently joining us or came over from Twitter, please be sure to subscribe for more City content. I will usually talk about players, the club, or just football in general. So without further ado, let's get started. As may you all know, the January transfer window of 2021 is approaching and it will be open within the next few days. Today have been linked with candidates from other European clubs, but for our first player, and a bit surprising, is David Alaba from Bayern Munich. Now on Twitter, and I'm quoting City Chief, it says that Man City have entered the race for David Alaba. Pep is a big fan after working with him at Bayern, where the pair had a good relationship. City are willing to offer Alaba a place in midfield knowing that he has long wanted to play there. Now this is a bit big considering that Pep Guardiola actually wants the player at the club and an eye catching detail is that he will join as a midfield. As many of you know, we are looking for a left back to sign knowing that Sinchenko isn't a natural left back and Mendy hasn't been given many games as well. <laughs> It will be interesting to see if we actually commit him to play fullback for us when it's needed or if he simply refuses and demands to only play in midfield. Here's another quote from Man City Extra. Pep Guardiola is a big fan of David Alaba and Man City are thinking about making a move offering him a place in midfield. The player is more open to a, a reunion with Guardiola but his preferred move would be to Real Madrid. This isn't surprising because we all know that Real Madrid is one of the biggest clubs in the world and every player wants to play for them at some point. Will we convince Alaba to join us? Who knows, but I wouldn't exactly scratch that out yet. Moving to our second candidate, we have Husum Awar from Lyon in the French League. If you don't know him, he's an excellent midfielder and he's also been linked to us in the past. Here's a tweet about it. PSG and Lyon will hold talks over Husum Awar in the spring. Man City and Juventus are also closely following the case. I do believe the player wants out of the club and is looking to join another league. Previously, it was rumored that Arsenal wanted the player and offered him a spot on the squad, but he decided to stay another season in France, hoping for other clubs to be interested in him. Personally, I think he's a great footballer with skills and potential. I do see him as a David Silva replacement playing along with Kevin De Bruyne and Phil Foden. He speaks French, so he will fit right in with Laporte, Mendy, and even Ryan Morris. I think his qualities is what we're missing in the team, especially creative players that allow us to help our attack and create chances for goal opportunities. I wouldn't get my hopes up yet since there is still more to come about his current situation, but it is something to keep an eye out for. Last but not least, we have the most popular one, Erling Haaland. This one has every City fan excited, including myself, the young Borussia Dortmund forward is planning a possible exit out of the Bundesliga, but his release clause in his contract cannot be activated until 2022. However, Dortmund can negotiate deals and can still sell the player. The only issue is that Haaland has a lot of interest from other clubs, and it will be very competitive to get him. Some people may question, how do we know Haaland is interested in City? Well, he hasn't openly said it, but there is evidence we can use as proof. These photographs have surrounded the internet of Haaland wearing City kits when he was young and even took a trip to the Etihad Stadium. Not to mention his father, Alfie Haaland, was also a City player back in his days. And if you're still not convinced, if you go over to his Twitter page and go through his likes, you will see that he likes the majority of City-related posts which means he is interested to see what is happening at our club. In my opinion, we should definitely break the bait and go all out for Haaland. I see him as the perfect Aguero replacement. He's young, he's a goal scoring machine, and not to mention his brand is absolutely massive. I say it is completely worth it on whatever numbers we decide. As long as we secure a deal with Dortmund, he will be destroying the Premier League. And that's basically it. That's all I got to say for this video. If you have any recommendations or want me to make a certain video about something, please be sure to leave a comment below. If you did enjoy, make sure you leave a like and consider subscribing. But other than that, it has been your boy and peace out.